play old time dance music, uh, old time mountain music, uh, mostly instrumental. It's meant for dancing. As the fellows you just saw, you know, they do a lot of original tunes and uh, modern things and perform beautifully. Skilled instrumentalist, we're kind of uh, amateur, I guess you say. <laughs> rough and ready old time dance band. Some of us are. tune we usually play that goes goes with that uh, what what uh, the dancers learn by we i'm going to play it a lot slower well, <laughs> while they're learning to dance do you dance you do do you flat foot dance oh no <laughs> oh, sorry. no oh, we could go get the dance you want to do that oh get the board out well, she denies think... she no, denies she, she doesn't well, Richard has been here enough to have finally I, I sort of flopped it around. I'm still bringing it up. Yeah, bring it up. We sometimes get dancers that drop by and so we bring their own boards and they dance all afternoon while we play. We do have a couple of good singers in the band too, though, and uh, like to feature them. How about something that you guys want to use? While the band plays Dixie, that'd be all right. <laughs> Wives and sweethearts far away. 
think uh, goes back to the Spanish American War? It's about the Spanish American War, yes. Mm -hmm. About the Carter family. About the Carter family. It's a good one. Would you want to do something like uh, Ain't Gonna Rain No More? It's up to you guys. I'm a hero, man. I think it's to have certain relevance. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to do it? No. Oh, well, we've got to vote against it. Okay. So I guess we can do it. It's a democracy. Well, I just think we should do a waltz and then we cry. Okay, let's do the kiss waltz. This is a waltz that actually comes uh, to us by way of Italy. Uh, more often, tunes, of course, have uh, Anglo-Irish origin. Uh, pretty obscure at that. But this one we know was actually composed by an Italian named Luigi Arditi back in the 1850s, and it somehow worked its way into the uh, fiddle repertoire. Uh, a little bit different. If you look at the sheet music, you'll find there's some differences, but this is an oral tradition after all. So here we go. Kiss Waltz. Um, il Bacho, they say. <laughs> Kiss Me Waltz. So it's a similar tune. It all goes back to Il Bacho. We'll do a, a kind of a local tune for you now, a regional favorite called Julianne Johnson.
one that uh, you can find a picture of the fiddler who first recorded that tune in there. He was a fellow named Emmett Lundy, and it was recorded in the 19, uh, late 1930s. He was a fellow that lived down around Galax, not too far from here. You might have heard Bob mention that sort of that this isn't bluegrass music, this is actually what we call old time music. It's a little earlier than bluegrass music. And we were playing that tune and it just made me remember how old time musicians are apt to fall into the groove. <laughs> you get to play in a tune and you just get, you know, it just carries you along. Because it's dance music, it sort of carries you along. And if they're dancers, that makes the groove all the more pleasant. That's true. There used to be this joke that was, you know, they said, what's the difference between an old time band and an AK-47? The AK-47 stops after 47 rounds. <laughs> well, especially in jams, you'll find that to be true. They'll, they, you know, nobody knows quite who's in charge. That's why you buy American. <laughs> That's why you buy American. <laughs> it just goes on and on. Well, the universally acknowledged signal that you're coming to the end of a tune is Somebody raises their foot like this. <laughs> Bob sort of blinks his eye. <laughs> They're great. They always seem to. It's all about the body language, Bob. You just know it's about to stop. Well, how about let's do Cinder? That's good. Here's an old familiar tune. I uh, can probably sing along with this on chorus. A lot of people learned this one in grade school, I think. I didn't. You didn't? <laughs> no, I had to learn it later. <laughs>
true story. Yeah. <laughs> Any dancers showed up yet? <laughs> we never know. Well, of course, I don't know that we're here this afternoon. So. We're going to do one more? Is that yeah. good? Okay. We're, this is about time we usually stop before we talk about it. We've had a much shorter time. Of today. We usually start at 12 o'clock, and we're, we uh, play every Monday out here. So if you're back on the parkway, uh, I hope you'll stop by and see us. Uh, <clears throat> And uh, if you're around this weekend and want to go to a dance, uh, come to the Allegheny Jubilee over here in Sparta Saturday night. And we'll be there playing for the dancers. And be glad to see you out there. All right, this is our last tune, and uh, thank you for listening. This is a, this is a tune called uh, Train 45. <laughs>